Hello and welcome to another Primavera P6 lesson by Global Project Control. In this lesson, we want to talk about how duration percent complete type formula works in Primavera P6. But at the first, let me to remove any previous update from this project. You know that why? If you like to understand it, please watch the above video for this subject. Right now, I need to start these activities. Actually, I have the fixed duration and unit percent complete time for this kind of activities, and my assumption is fixed for all the activities. So, let's to come back to the status. All the activities are started, and let me to apply for 50% progress for these activities. As you see, 50% is well distributed to all the activities by fill down. And let's see what happened to our activity. If you have the physical percent complete time for your activity and the duration type is fixed duration and unit, then when you update your activity percentage, for 50%, it is not affected on your duration percent complete. It happens if your activity includes the resources or your activity is resourceless. But about duration percent complete, if you update the activity percent complete, it's affected on your duration percent complete time and activity percent complete, but it's not affected to your physical percent complete. It affects your activity with resource or without resources. But about unit percent complete, as you see, it is not affected on your duration percent complete type. You need to update your project data date. Let me to select the another date. Then, as you see, you cannot find any changes. Why? Because you need to update the remaining, for instance, for 10 days. Then you will reach to duration percent complete type at your unit percent completed. So, if your duration percent complete type is duration, and your duration type is fixed duration and unit, you don't need to update any other field to reach to the percentage for duration percent complete. But if you have the unit percent complete for percent complete type, it is not affected on your duration percent complete. But why? This is the formula for duration percent complete. We have original duration minus the remaining duration on the numerator and original duration on the denominator. So for this project we have, I changed the layout for better understanding what happened to the prim of our P6 and add remaining duration and actual duration to my layout. And I split the page to two sections. Right now, let me to try to count to calculate the duration percent complete. We have 20 days as the original duration, and my remaining duration is only 10 days. So, original duration minus the remaining duration divided to my original duration is equal to. 50%. As you see, we have 50% as a progress. If you want to calculate the for other activity, you can calculate it. This formula works for all duration percent complete field in Primavera P6. And also, please notice that the schedule percent complete progress is completely different with duration percent complete. It shows us 50%, 100%, but we don't have any progress for duration percent complete for this activity. 
and we have 50% in versus with 70%. I hope this lesson is useful for you. Thank you for watching Global Project Control. I hope this lesson is useful for you. Please keep in touch with my LinkedIn, YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook for further lesson. Also, you can visit my website www.globalprojectcontrol.com in order to find all of my lesson and courses in the same time. Thank you for your subscription at my YouTube channel.